Okay, I want to show you my uh, little uh, HHO system, Brown's gas, whatever you want to call it. So basically, what I I uh, I run the Ethos uh, ester in my fuel, and that helps to reduce the emissions and increase the mileage. And although the company is, only sells it in bulk now, it's kind of hard to get, but uh, I still have a little bit. And also, uh, occasionally I run uh, Citrusol, uh, which helps to, uh, I think it helps to uh, sort of emulsify the fuel as well. And then uh, a bit of acetone occasionally. Um, I always put a magnet on my oil filter. I don't know if you can see it there. Uh, yeah, it's kind of hard to see down there, but uh, basically, if you put a magnet on your oil filter, uh, it helps to pull some of the uh, debris out of the oil and keep it out of suspension. And so, on this on this system, I've got one coming in from the uh, the uh, evaporator uh, right from the uh, the the, uh, the fume intake, whatever, from the, uh, the gas tank, and so. This is the one that comes from the evaporator from the gas tank. So what I've done is put the HHO, HHO feed into that. And then also I've got another one here. I just feed it directly into the top of the uh, air intake. And so, and then what I wanted to talk about a little bit is the GEEK system. I found this, this is actually a part for a uh, a dishwasher and this is very similar to the GEET system um, and I want to show you another one over here uh, so basically the GEET system of uh, the center pipe would be the fuel pipe and it would be closed on this end similar and it would be similar to this end over here so the center pipe would go through as the fuel and it would uh, create a sort of a vortex effect and uh, and help the fuel burn more efficiently uh, and then this this here the outside pipe would be the exhaust uh, heating up the internal pipe which would be the fuel and then also creating sort of vortex or uh, sort of a tornado effect with the fuel Anyway, I wanted to show you my other one uh, I was working on. So I've got a little HHO generator here and I've got it feeding into the uh, uh, intake from the uh, PVC directly into the intake there. And I've also got another one here. And uh, <clears throat> so this one's a little low on fluid at this point. Basically I mix in water and uh, a little oil, maybe a little citrus salt, maybe a little uh, ethos, uh, you know, kind of anything. I've got excess around. I've got a kind of a extra feeder. This actually sucks directly from the intake manifold, so I'm I'm bubbling it through here. So I'm sucking, uh, uh, bubbling it through the fluid, and so I'm getting it there. And I also have a magnet on this one as well. And then I had the uh, these fuel resonator chips, they were similar to what BioPro had. Uh, basically, they resonate, it's a polymer that resonates the frequency of oxygen that helps the fuel burn uh, more completely. <clears throat> and then this one here, I've also got, I just wrapped the, uh, the O2 sensor up a little bit so it wouldn't cool as much. And so theoretically, um, it's going to be telling the computer that it's going to be hotter than it normally is and it's going to be uh, decreasing the fuel and so anyway that's a little bit about my little uh, <clears throat> HHO systems hope you enjoy it uh, rate comment and subscribe